And I saw a great white throne, and him that sat on it, from whose face the earth and the heaven fled away, and there was found no place for them. And I saw the dead, small and great, stand before God, and the books were opened. And another book was opened, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of those things which were written in the books, according to their works. And the sea gave up the dead which were in it. And death and hell delivered up the dead which were in them. And they were judged, every man according to their works. And death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death. Whosoever was not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire. Right now, what will happen is, starting in kindergarten, they'll talk to them about same-sex or gay marriage, um, and the, ch the parents will not be able to opt out. The big, one of the big issues is, in Virginia, parents can opt their children out of certain parts of the, quote, family life education. And so now what they're doing is they're trying to move parts of it from FLE, family life education, to health, which means the parents cannot opt their children out. And so we've been pouring over the regulations and the information to see exactly what's happening. But we are very, very concerned that they are doing it here in Fairfax County and perhaps other places without the parents' knowledge or consent. In eighth grade, they will be discussing, let me just say, Bill Clinton's activity along with oral and anal. Um, in eighth grade, and most people, and, that, and they've lowered it from ninth grade, or teaching fourth graders about the word incest. How far does that go? Outraged after their daughters were forced to pretend to be lesbians in front of the classmates. The Linden Avenue Middle School anti-bullying campaign focused on homosexuality and gender identity. Parents say their daughters were embarrassed by the role playing. Parent Mandy Kuhn told reporters, quote, she told me, mom, we all get teased and picked on enough. Now I'm going to be called a lesbian because I had to ask another girl if I could kiss her. Kuhn says parents were given no warning of the event and no choice to opt out. School administrators defended the workshop and say they're planning more. Well, we've already found a, a secret memo uh, coming out of the Justice Department. They're, they're, they're now going to go after 12 new perversions, things like bestiality, uh, polygamy, uh, uh, having sex with little boys and making that legal. And, uh, and, and not only that, but they have a whole list of strategies to uh, go after the churches, the pastors, and, and any businesses that uh, tries to assert their religious liberty. This is coming, and it's coming like a tidal wave. All right, so talk, uh, Congressman, I just want to get this straight. So you, you, you are aware of a Justice Department memo where, that says there will be an effort to, to legitimize or legalize bestiality, uh, pedophilia, and, as you put it, perversions? That's correct. That's correct. They're coming down with 12, 12 new perversions. <laughs> Uh, the LGBT just isn't uh, the be is only the beginning. Uh, they're going to start expanding it to the other uh, perversions. All right. Well, I, I, you know, not, nothing anymore would surprise me. Absolutely nothing would surprise me. of his might put on the whole armor of God that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil for we wrestle not against flesh and blood but against principalities 
against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Oh, yeah. 